Ladies and gents, welcome to the crib. As you can see in the background, that is my, oh, that's my dog as well. That is my desk and my, my little bit of operation um, where I am during the day, where I'm running programs and all that sort of stuff. And luckily enough, what I'm gonna set up next to it is going to be a little gym area. So behind me here, we're gonna set up a little bit of a gym. Um, we're gonna do a little bit of a gym transformation video today and see how it all goes. We'll take a fair bit of time to sort it all out. Um, hopefully Coco will give me a hand. She, she gives me nothing sometimes, but yeah, we'll see how we go. Coco, what's going on, mate? This is my beautiful dog, Coco. She doesn't give me much. She's not very affectionate sometimes. Come here. Sometimes she is though. <laughs> All right, so this is the gym area. We've, it's about 20 square meters. Um, at the moment, we've kind of been using it for a games room, but as you can see, it's a little bit messy. Uh, we've got some uh, laying deck chairs there. We've got a pool table. We've got a little bit of a Weber um, a fridge, obviously, there. Um, pool sticks and then back through here we've got all the surfboards and all of that stuff as well So what we're pretty much going to do today is give it a big clean out um, And uh, give it a bit of a mop and all that sort of stuff and hopefully set up the gym um, In a way where it will look absolutely sick. We're probably going to put up a, um, a mirror over there We've just installed these lights here as well The lights look fantastic obviously you need a little bit of down lighting but yeah, that's what we're going to do, the big home gym setup. This pool table is really heavy, so I might need some help to move it, but I'm the only person that lives here, so I might have to call one of my mates or something. Anyway, we'll sort it all out. As you can see, we've actually got the pool in there, which is pretty cool, um, that you can look straight through there. A little bit, um, a little bit weird, I guess. Uh, but yeah, that's going to be the setup. Let's we'll see how we go. So like I said before, that's the um, that's the prime training office, the downstairs office. Um, in there is actually my bedroom as well, so it's all on the same level. This is the downstairs deck area. We've actually got an upstairs deck area as well. But yeah, this is the downstairs deck area that I won't uh, be using. This will kind of just be keeping what it is. Um, and yeah, like I said, in there, we will have a very nice little home gym. Before I even start this video, I want to say a massive shout out to Sumo Strength. So Sumo Strength have um, helped me set up my home gym. They've been fantastic with helping me out. So if you guys do want to set up a home gym or if you just want any gym equipment whatsoever, make sure you go and check out Sumo Strength. You can use the code BOLSHI5. I'll put it down in the description as well. Make sure you go check out Sumo Strength. I was looking at all different um, places on, on where to get the best gym gear. Sumo Strength has fantastic prices um, and they also have fantastic gear. So make sure you go and check them out. That is my, uh, that's my promo for the start of the video, uh, but it's not actually a real promo because I actually really do believe in their stuff and, and love it. So make sure you go check them out. Use my code, get some discounts, be good. Alrighty, first things first, we've got to get this massive pool table out, which we've done. We've put some um, things on the bottom of it just to move it out. So this will now be probably a bit of a pool area. Um, we need to give that a little bit of a clean there. Uh, as we look into the gym, we've kind of done a little bit of a clean up, not really. Uh, but as you can see, it's pretty uh, dirty and all that sort of stuff. So we're going to keep uh, moving some things out. Got to move out this fridge and the rest of this stuff. First thing though was the pool table, so good thing that we got that out. Um, but yeah, we've got to move, move a few other things out of here, set it up, got the boxing bag there. And um, as you know, there's, I'm not getting a lot of help from my, um, my housemate here. Coco, you've done absolutely nothing to help me set this up. But that's all right, uh, that's all good, Coco. You just do what you got to do. But yeah, got to keep moving stuff out and give it a bit of a clean. Let's get it. <laughs> you silly dog. All right, legend, so we've given it all a sweep out um, and all a uh, bit of a bit of a wash, bit of a wipe down. Uh, now we're gonna start putting these mats down. We've got about 20 mats. Uh, we've gotta fit them all in. Um, so yeah, we'll see how we go. All right, we're halfway through the flooring and it looks pretty freaking decent so far. Now you can see down that end, we do have a little bit of an extra, so we're just gonna have to cut that off. Um, but holy crap, it looks pretty insane right here. 
pretty keen. So we've just been upstairs to chill out a little bit and um, have a dip in the pool and all that sort of stuff. As you can see right there, that's the pool. Uh, but yeah, so this is what the go is at the moment. Uh, like I said before, we've got a bit of the flooring done. We've got a little bit more flooring to get through um, before we're completely finished. Um, and then we can just start to move the weights and stuff down here, which will be good fun. So we're slowly just grinding through it, um, putting the mats down, making sure it stays nice and clean, keeping the feet uh, off the mats as much as we can. Um, but yeah, there you go. Hopefully it, uh, hopefully it looks sick at the end. Oh my god! Look at this! Oh shit! Wow! Look at it from here! Wow! Guys, I'm pretty useless at this sort of shit, so I had to get the old man onto the tools to figure out how to do it, because I am useless. I am absolutely terrible. So the old man sorted it out. For this bit, I'm gonna try and um, I'm gonna try and sort out this little edge here of the of the mat that's no good, and try and cut some of them. But uh, yeah, the old man's definitely come in clutch for me. On the tools, as you know, trying to get this gym bloody right. It's tough. It's hard, yakka. But um, geez, I'm actually pretty good on the saw here. We've got the interior designer here, Rochelle Bolsch. Looking shredded. Coco as well. Coco, I've told you before, you're off this. This is not, come on, off. This is not your gym. Get off. So oh, while I love you, darling. Designing, there's only one person working. <laughs> yeah, because he can't teach anyone else how to do it. <laughs> uh oh, family feud. Family feud. Coco, family feud here. Teaching's no, he's working hard. We're thinking of putting mirrors up here, like I said before, and then maybe mirrors down here as well. We'll see how we go with all of that. I was thinking of putting artificial grass here as well. Yeah. Don't like the artificial grass? I hate artificial grass. Yeah, I didn't think so. I had to Uber Eats in a side bowl. I was getting a bit hungry. We've just figured out that we've put all of these, these things here around the wrong way. So we're going to have to take it down and change it around. A bit fucking annoying, but that's alright. So we'll change these around so you can put the dip bars in. My fault, obviously. I've set it up wrong. Pretty standard. We keep munching on this acai bowl. Look at that. Bro. I don't say this much, but holy moly. I've done a freaking fantastic job of that. Look at that. Expert measurer, expert cutter. This one, obviously, a bit hard to be expert cutter. Hey! Turn the lights back on. What are you doing? Yeah, it's those ones there. Oh, wow. Are we having a look at this right now? Holy moly. Bolchie's coming clutch. What do you reckon? You're pretty proud of your presentation there? Well, there's just two of the rubber bits that are missing, but... Two rubber bits? Oh, for the things. Otherwise, we... I know what you're talking about, mate. Third dog bit. So, Rach, you've turned those lights on. Two rubber oh, bits there. Maybe they're on... Find it. Sorry. Bro, look at how much I'm sweating. Holy... Guys, this is almost... Almost done. We're still trying to figure it out. We've got some wrong parts here with the um, with the uh, bench press, um, but the squat rack looks insane. Like it looks incredible. Shout out to the old man for helping me out, or let's not say helping me out. Let's just say pretty much doing it uh, because I'm pretty, as you know, pretty fucking useless at this sort of stuff. Uh, but yeah, look at that. It looks really sick. Um, We've still got a few, we've got bands and uh, balls and dumbbells and stuff coming down, but this is uh, how it's looking at the moment. It's looking very, very impressive. So we'll see how we go with the rest of it, try and set it up for tonight. Um, and then I guess we've got a few other things that we've got to add in. Again, another shout out to Sumo Strength for sorting it all out. They have been absolutely amazing um, sorting it all out. Obviously, if you need any Sumo Strength stuff, We've got the link down in the description with my discount code as well, which they've got a massive sale at the moment. They've got like 20% off and then I get, get you another 5% off. So definitely go check them out if you're trying to set up a home gym. 
um, because they are absolutely incredible. But yeah, I'll be back. Wow. Legends, what the hell I have spent and my family as well definitely helped me out. No word of a lie. Um, the last week setting this up and it looks absolutely insane. Um, I'll give you a full tour in a second, but as you can see behind, you've got the scroll rack, massive again. Shout out to Sumo Strength who set it all up for me. It's incredible. I'll show you everything that I've got in the home gym and everything that I use um, that I think is essential for training and training like an athlete and all that sort of stuff. Um, everything that I think um, is essential to have in your gym or in your home gym. And if you don't have it, then you probably should go and grab it or at least think about it. But yeah, I'll give you a bit of a tour. Um, but yeah, it looks incredible. I can't wait to, to use it.